Meanwhile, Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau was at a loss for words as he struggled to answer a reporter's question on his thoughts on U.S. President Donald Trump's decision of military mobilization against violent protests in the United States. Here is what he had to say. You've been reluctant to comment on uh, the words and actions of the U.S. President, but we do have Donald Trump now calling for military action against protesters. We saw protesters tear gas yesterday to make way for a presidential photo op. I'd like to ask you what you think about that. And if you don't want to comment, what message do you think you're sending? We all watch in horror and consternation what's going on in the United States. It is a time uh, to pull people together, but it is a time to listen. It is a time to learn what injustices continue despite progress uh, over years and decades. But it is a time for us as Canadians to recognize that we too have our challenges. That Black Canadians and racialized Canadians face discrimination as a lived reality every single day. There is systemic discrimination in Canada, which means our systems treat Canadians of color, Canadians who are racialized differently than they do others. It is something that many of us don't see, but it is something that is a lived reality for racialized Canadians.